Yo, uh, uh, Go XLR, what's really going on? I mean, I spent all this money on my Go XLR just to say y'all are outdating, like y'all are giving it up, just quitting, just like leaving. Deuces, Chris Brown deuces. It's all right, it's all right. I still love y'all because it is a great product. Now, let me tell you something. Go XLRs, if you're having a problem with this one thing, this one thing that keeps popping up, let me show you. Just, just look, oh, we're gonna put it over here? Okay, look at it. Actually, let's, let's put it right here. You see this message? Do you see this? Were, were you freaking out? Were you like, is it over? Is it Go XLR? Is it done? Do I need to buy something new? Actually, you don't. It's a simple, quick fix. All right, so we're looking at this thing, the Go XLR. <laughs> By the way, this is a Sony ZV-1 camera that I'm using because people are like, what type of camera do you use? It's Sony ZV-1, really love it. Um, but yeah, the Go XLR, beautiful thing, right? I've been using it for a while. It's positioned right here. I'm actually have my Go XLR uh, cable to my uh, Sherm SM75. I call it a Sherm mic, but it's actually called a Sherm mic. Um, and I've been using it for about two years now in my streaming platform and setup. So, um, I got an error message, okay, today from this thing. You know what I'm saying? I was like, an error message? Like, what's going on? I do music. I do everything. By the way, if you want to subscribe to my channel, go ahead and hit the subscribe button. If you want to subscribe to my Twitch or any other channel that I have down there, Twitter, go ahead and hit the follow button because I make l music live. I play a lot of uh, games from Call of Duty to... I'm probably going to be playing some party animals pretty soon, but yeah. Uh, so yeah, uh, back to this. I have ADHD really bad. Don't, don't worry about it. Uh, so yeah, on my lunch break, I had about um, 10 to 15 minutes and I got an error message. And this error message kept popping up, right? And I'm going to put this error message right here. Boom! There it is. You see the error message? It's right there. And I just start freaking out. I said, go XLR is done. I got to buy something new. Not in my budget. I know it's around the holidays. I missed the Black Friday stuff. And quite frankly... There's always a solution to your problems. So uh, this is how you fix it. All you need to do is go to the Go XLR. Uh, what do you call the thing? Helicon, telecon. I messed up a lot of words. Oh yeah, this thing, this that word right there. Uh, to helicon. All you need to do is go to that. Download and update the drivers. I'm going to show you how to do it really quickly. Uh, uh, oh, you, I got, I got to show you right quick. So let me. Uh, yeah, just check it out. This is how you do it. All right, so this is how we do it. So as we're just gonna look, you're just gonna go to Telecon uh, right here. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna click on downloads, right? It's gonna take it to the downloads. Actually, let's go to the homepage now. Boom, there it is. Such a beautiful setup. Why are you guys going out of business? Let's not get it over. I don't know. Okay, but I like my Go XLR. Uh, if you guys come out with something new and need a sponsor, just hit me up, that's real nice. <laughs> all right, you're gonna hit click downloads. Whichever one of these you have, you see, you see all these are listed right here. Whichever one of these you have. I went to the most recent download driver you got to go get the drive you got to know how to drive that thing skirt okay and so you got to go get the driver download that thing i've already downloaded and then this is the key make sure your windows is updated make sure all your drivers are updated all your other drivers are updated on your windows or whatever you have or uh and make sure you have updated them through your system before doing this so you're going to click download i've already had to download it they're going to put in your download folder you're going to open it up you're gonna download the driver, but here is the key, okay? Here is the key. After you download it, make sure your Go XLR is closed out, even though if you're getting the error message or not. You gotta close all that out. Close all that out. After it downloads, you have to do this one thing. <laughs> it's this one thing that had me tripping because I thought it was over. You gotta restart your computer. <laughs> you gotta restart it. It's just that simple. Restart your computer and voila. You hit the Go XLR app on your desktop. XLR. Boom. And then it just pops right back up. Boom. There it is. Working for you. Okay. Working for you. Now, I've set my Go XLR to a company, uh, not to a company, to assist with my music and what I do on live on stream. Uh, if you need help setting up your Go XLR, let me know. Drop a comment. I know these are going to be outdated uh, pretty soon, which they already are. Uh, but we will find solutions around to keep these things going because I think this is a powerful piece of equipment for you streamers, anybody that's doing entertainment on social media channels, anything. You see how good I sound? I can just do stuff like this. Y'all want to see it? Hello. 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 I can do stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? I don't want to get really deep. You know what I'm saying? I'm sorry.
You're right. Oh, uh, but by the way, oh sorry. Uh, <laughs> but by the way, thank you for checking out this video. Uh, if you have any more questions, put them below. Uh, comment. But uh, this is the quick fix to get the driver error message corrected. I'm out of here.